Huh. That wasn't too shabby. <laughs> Snow plow boogie. Well, welcome to 2022, sports fans. It is January, and we got our first snow. Um, it's, uh, what is it, January, like, mm, it's January 7th, and we got our first snow. Um, not a big snow, but I uh, wanted to show you uh, a new development in the arsenal of tools that Captain T has. Yep, that's right. Got ourselves a snow plow, uh, a boss snow plow and you can see that the driveway doesn't have much on it so we don't have much to prove it on but uh this is going to be the maiden voyage of captain t piloting a snowplow and the main reason is because the arm so the arm's still not right uh we're still trying to make that work uh we have not been out on the water but effectively i am on frozen water today so we'll uh we'll give this a try and we'll see what happens stay tuned Let's see how we did. This would ordinarily have probably taken me about two hours. I'd say that's pretty good work. Okay, next we're gonna snow plow Eva out. Out for now, sports fans. So it turns out that uh, Eva's driveway got plowed by her new landlord, uh, the wonderful and generous and incredible Greg Curry. Um, I didn't have to do any other neighbors because we didn't really have that much snow and I had a dickens of a time getting this thing off. This is uh, not an easy procedure. I mean it looks easy when you're going through it with the salesman. <laughs> you pick up the plow. But uh, do yourself a favor sports fans. Leave snow removal to the professionals. And uh, if you got a bad arm like me, like Captain T here, especially if it's your casting arm, go ahead and get a snow plow and take care of stuff. But I got to tell you, this is no mean feat. And uh, hats off to all of you snow removal professionals. You guys do a heck of a job. I, uh, I don't want to be out of here. I need to go where it's warm. I wonder what the weather's like in Isla Mirada right now. 